Fatty Fatty Jumbalati. This is for all the people that look in the mirror and they just got like a gut hanging out or maybe you only got to cut like four to five pounds and you don't, you don't like really need to be cut, doing all the extreme stuff I said in the last video. But this will, this will make you lose. This will bring you down to like, personally, I think your athletic peak. Like just like, like, like at whatever point you're at, you know what I mean, in your development, this will just bring you to a nice controlled level, okay? Basically, what I, what I would do, all right, this is like, this, this might not be true for everyone, but basically what I would do is I would starve myself all day, only drink water, work out twice really hard, work out twice, maybe three times really hard. That's a wrestling practice and a run, and then maybe another run before bed or in the morning depending on like if I'm really trying to lose weight. And this is this is like off season stuff too. Like 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 you can like if if you this is just good to practice. This is just good discipline to have in my opinion. You know what I mean? If you can do this, this is just good discipline to have. And then you eat one 2000 calorie every single day. You only drink water, work out two to three times a day, do your hard practices, do everything you can and have one 2000 calorie meal a day. All right, this is for the people with excess body fat. They gotta lose three to four pounds. They gotta, you know, if it's three to four, you can, if, this will pretty much bring you down to like 10% body fat religiously. This will like, like, if you're doing this, if you're working out twice a day hard for like upwards of two hours, okay? If you're working two plus hours a day hard, all right, getting your heart rate above 130 BPMs, I think that's normal or whatever it is, if you're getting your heart rate up basically to like whatever a good rate is, look it up, I don't know. This will almost guaranteed bring you down to weight, all right? You're eating one meal a day, only drinking water, you're working out twice a day, and you could do this one of two ways. You could eat complete shit and feel like shit. You could eat like a bunch of car empty carbs and like, like fruit roll-ups and like just a bunch of shit, but processed shit. Or you could eat like, Basically, my rule of thumb is if it was once living, plant or animal, it is good for me. You know what I mean? If it's a bee, if it's a fish, if it's whatever, you know what I mean? Whatever it is, just as long as it had a life force, that's better than something that didn't. That's better than just like sugar candy. You know what I mean? It's better than just like all that crap. If it's still like, like personally, I think eating three oranges is better than a glass of orange juice. That's just my opinion. I don't know why, but in my experience, like, you just like feel better and you lose more weight. You gen orange juice, I am convinced is fucking sugar water, bro. I'm, I, I am convinced, and I live in Florida. I am convinced once it turns into orange juice, it is literally just so bad for you. Like, like eating three oranges does not sit in me the same way a glass of orange juice does. Like it just doesn't. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Just cut out all the fat. You wanna get, you wanna get to like, like a competitive body fat percentage in wrestling is between six and 8%. All right, once you're between six and 8%, then you start cutting out water. That's when you start like, that's when you start doing the extreme stuff, Epsom salt baths, like all that extra stuff. All right, if you're eating three meals a day, if you're just very undisciplined, then like you're, you're causing your body way too much harm, all right? I made that video, that video is for someone that's competing at a high level and they're like, they, they're already doing everything they can. They're already eating as many calories as they can. They're on a meal plan. You know what I mean? They, they're, already, they're already doing everything that they can when they're not having to lose weight, okay? That's what yesterday's video is. The, today's video is for just your general competitor. This is like, this is like if you wanna be competitive at your weight class, because once you get above like 15% body fat, you gotta think you're gonna be wrestling kids and adults with 6%, 8% body fat. They're gonna have six to eight percent of their weight not be fat it's gonna be muscle it's gonna be power and agility it's not gonna be fatty fatty jumbalati all right it's not gonna be jiggle it's gonna be you know what i mean like like it makes like it makes a real difference it makes a real difference and you will drop i've seen people drop four weight classes all right in, in a summer in a summer of just a disciplined eating they will go from 190 to 152 all right it's very possible and the only person stopping you in general is you. Because, bro, if you're drinking water, if you're drinking water, it is so fucking hard to start to death. It is so fucking hard to start to death, I am telling you. If you're drinking water, that is like 99% of the battle. 
That's 99% of the battle. If you eat one, if you eat two grapes every 15 days, I'm sure you're gonna be fine. All right, until you like get beneath like 10 body fat percentage. Obviously super extreme. You won't build a bunch of muscle eating two grapes every 15 days. But I'm saying like, you're not gonna die. You can push yourself. You're gonna be hungry. It is good to be hungry. It is good to be hungry sometimes. All right, 23 hours of the day, you should have no food going in your mouth. That means no grapes, no nuts, no berries, no nothing, no nothing. In one meal, you eat all 2,000 calories. Just have a feast. Just have a big feast, okay? And you're gonna, I promise you, you will shed so much weight. All right, if you like that video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Check out my channel. I post a new video every day at nine. Uh, if you guys have any questions, just hit me up on Instagram. I answer like pretty much all my DMs now. But uh, until next time, I'll see you guys.